Hey YouTube, Safety here. Just a little update on my wagon power dome. So this guy's really handy. I'm just in love with it. Um, I'm down to just one right now, but I'm going to pick up another one definitely. Along with another solar panel eventually and a bigger power inverter. But I just figured out another way to charge this guy and you'll be amazed. Alright, so the cost to have this guy right here doing what he's doing for me right now I'm about to show you. And to charge him under two hundred dollars yeah under under two hundred this guy was about one twenty five maybe a hundred and thirty dollars and then the two little panels that I have charged him I actually paid too much I paid about thirty dollars a piece for them because I had to get shipping and everything but I just found them at the hardware store for like sixteen and they were designed for my bike and everything I'd men I've mentioned them in previous videos I've just never shown them but today I'm gonna show them so uh... alright so this guy's charging right now let me Go down, see the little red light? So he's charging, so he's actively taking power from, if you look right back here, I've got that receptacle that I showed, and it's it's got power too. And then we've got my two little miniature solar panels that I paid $30 a piece for. I've seen them for $16.99 at the hardware store. Attached right to that receptacle. And now look, we're going to follow this line. It goes right out this door. Look, this. I mean, you could do this in your car, driving down the road. You can mount these to your ceiling of the car. I mean, it is incredible, and it's a sunny day, but I just showed a weather report just a second ago, that's on the post right away, that uh, there was just an earthquake in Japan, and the weather here is, I mean, it's a nice day, it's just the sun break through, but, I mean, I've got a street lamp, well, my street lamp's kind of slow, but <laughs> it's on right now, I mean, that shows how much California, let's, wait, let me see if I can get, catch this, look at this, it's a sunny day in California, and the city street lamp is on, Petaluma, California. Turn off your lights. Come on, look at, look at what I'm trying to do here. Help me out here. But, uh, yeah, it's windy too. Man, if I had a turbine, look at, let's see if I can show some of this. Look at that. I mean, look at the wind coming through here. Look at my chimes. They're going nuts. If I had a wind turbine, let's see, I'll show you. I want to mount it. Look at those trees. I want to mount it right there. I'll put like five all around my chimney. Do you know how much I could power my whole house off wind turbine right there? I mean, it'd be big, but it'd be quiet. And my neighbor wouldn't mind too much, but you know this, this is the this is all I'm doing. I mean, look look at how big these are. These are smaller than my hand. I mean, and this twenty dollars a piece. I mean, forty dollars. Come on, I spent two hundred and thirty on the one in the backyard. Yeah, these will take probably like three times as long to charge. But actually, I should get my amp meter here. I'm gonna grab my amp meter and we're gonna pop back on here and we're gonna test these inside. Now we're inside and you can see that. Um, these little solar panels aren't doing much, but, but, they are generating power. Now my panel in the backyard, I mean you can see you get what you pay for, my panel in my backyard is um, putting out on average two during the sun, while the sun's up, but definitely in the morning, I mean this is the reading that I get in the morning and right before I go to bed before it totally, the sun's gone completely. You know, and those little panels are in full sunlight right now. I wouldn't recommend going out and buying like a hundred of those because you're going to spend, you know, like a thousand dollars and it's not going to be worth it. But in the case of an extreme emergency where there's absolutely no PG&E that exists anymore and it's not, un I mean, a, a three-day blackout in the middle of summer. What it California has got their lights on in the middle of the day. I mean... If I'm pretty sure that they swapped out for an energy efficient bulb there, but if it's running all day long, how much energy are they really saving? Plus, that bulb's gonna go out way faster. So, <laughs> come on, the, the cities and the states and Calif California, the whole West Coast, everyone, they need to pull together wind power, solar power. We make it happen. I mean, this thing will charge. If we were out camping, I could put this and those panels out in the middle of the sun for a day or two, maybe three, and in the nighttime, I could run, run run a lamp for a second. I could charge some batteries for my flashlights. I could actually do something. So, it's this is just a great way to actually make make generate some power for uh, under two hundred bucks. Solar 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 panel setup for under two hundred dollars. It works. Plus, this thing's just a great product to have around. So, um, and you can probably find better panels too. These are some cheapo little panels. So, stay safe, YouTube. Till next time.